All right, so now we're going to learn looping. And uh, a loop is going to be three parts. And I think you could just, yeah, you could just throw any of these parts away. And you could use your loop using programming logic to do whatever you want to do. And a loop starts out with four. It doesn't like that. And front.println. Hello. Well, now it likes it. So uh, that's going to loop eternally. There is no break on that. Want to hear my computer's fan spin? What are we in? 20. Ah, ah, control C. That's it. A forever loop. I'm going to comment that one out. The next thing is for, and it's going to be init, condition, incrementer, and then code. So those are the parts that you can use. An initializer for i colon equals zero. A condition i is less than or equal to 100. Let's just do 10. And incrementer i plus plus code format dot print line i i i i i i i i I think we're going to have to listen to it. And now we did that loop. Loop, 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 de loop. Pretty sweet. And we can leave any of those parts out, I think. But that's just my theory, right? Like maybe we don't want the, in the evaluation. So what's that look like? We get rid of the evaluation. Weep. And we just put in here if i is equal to 11 break and we will uh you know print i i just so we have a difference oh there's no i it'll have to be i i Woo! right print it 11 and then it broke so it's just like a different way you know we left out the condition right here. And we just use programming. We put it here. We could have put a break in up here. You know, like right here. We could have said, if this happens, break. Could have had the break right there. We could put the incrementer down here and get rid of the incrementer up here. So, you know, no good reason to do that. But, And I'm going to thump to my code to see what it looks like, see if any changes happen. A little bit got cleaned up. All right, so you just have to remember for init condition incrementer. So that's the basics of looping. And in the next one, we're going to see range. We've already seen range, but we'll talk about it. Oh, let me give you a little assignment. I want you to uh, do a for loop, make numbers count up to 10. Do it, do it. Sorry until I wacky. <laughs>